From your local election headquarters, Oklahomans will vote on raising the minimum wage. But you know what? That vote won't happen for nearly two years. News 4's Amaya Ward joins us with details. So, Amaya, why the long delay here? Kevin Jolene, the governor says it boils down to money. Advocates raising for raising the minimum wage are now accusing him of playing politics. I'm disappointed but not shocked that Governor Stitt um, is trying to play politics with the lives of Oklahomans. More than 157,000 Oklahomans signed their names in support of state question 832, which would raise the minimum wage in Oklahoma. The signatures well over the 92,000 that were required to bring the question to the ballots. This is 320,000 Oklahomans who could have been given a pay raise through the passage of state question 832. The state's current minimum wage is $7.25 per hour. State question 832 would have raised a minimum wage to $9 per hour in 2025 and continuing to raise it by $1.50 each year until it reaches $15 in 2029. Tuesday, Governor Stitt set the question to appear on the gubernatorial primary ballot in June 2026, saying in part, this choice saves taxpayers over $1.8 million and prevents the need for the election board to request supplemental funding from the legislature to arrange a standalone statewide election. And the governor could have put this on the ballot in 70 days and he chose not to. Those supporters were hopeful the measure would be on the November ballot. Opponents say they are going to do everything they can to make sure the minimum wage stays exactly where it is. It doesn't kind of really matter when it's on the ballot. We're going to be opposed to it. I think it's bad policy for Oklahoma. Every year you're going to have uncertainty as what the minimum wage is going to be It'll increase based on the CPI number. Meanwhile, advocates for the question say they will be ready. When we get to June 2026 and we've had these conversations with Oklahoma voters, it will be a no brainer. The order also explains that beginning in 2030, the minimum wage would actually increase annually based on if there is any increase in the cost of living. Thank you, Amaya.